Hello kiddos and welcome to Home Schooling with Hera. I'm your teacher Hera and today I'm here with a new sound for you. So, let's get started. But before we learn something new, as always, we will revise our previously learned sounds. And I hope you remember them. If you don't, repeat after me. All right. So the first sound is ooh ooh. Two sounds ooh ooh. A E I O J O or R Ch Sh A E E O A and O. Kudos! I heard you. You know all these sounds. So let's get going and listen to our today's story. I know that in the last video I have told you this story, but if you remember, I told you that this digraph, these two letters together, make two sounds. So in the last video, we did the th sound, which is when you stick out your tongue a little further and say th. And in today's video, we will do the second sound of this digraph, which is th th. Right? So listen to the story once again. I believe you will enjoy it and then we'll do the worksheets. Okay. Matthew and Nathan have gone to the circus. The ringmaster opens the circus and introduces the acts. First, there is a juggler throwing three rings high into the air. Then, two naughty clowns throw water at the ringmaster. One clown, a thin fellow, is rather rude. He sticks his tongue out at the ringmaster, but only a little way. Th he goes. The other clown, who is much bigger, is very rude. He sticks his tongue right out. Th 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 he goes. Then the clowns chase one another and tickle each other with feathers. Everyone laughs at them. And this is our story of the th and th sound. And to write th and th, we have to use t and h together. Now let's look at the action of this sound. Pretend to be a rude clown and stick out your tongue a little for Th, as in this, and further for th, as in thumb. These are the picture for the th and the th sounds. Okay, now time to see how to write it. Fingers up in the air. You know how to write the t sound, so go down and turn up a little. Straight line at the top for h. Go down, come up, round and down. Together, t and h make the new sounds th and th. Right? Now it's time to solve our worksheets. If you want to get these worksheets, tell your mama that they are available on Miss Hera's website, Homeschooling with Hera. And let's get cracking. Listen to the sound carefully and wherever you hear the th sound, th. The, the, like this, you have to circle that picture. Okay? The father rhinoceros. Father rhinoceros. Father the, the, the. Okay? The shirt mother. Shirt mother. The mother. Here? The feather bed, feather bed, the feather, the spider and weathers. These are weathers. The spider weather, weather, the. Soother or gorilla. Soother 
or gorilla. Soothe. Ta-da! I hope that you have finished your worksheet. Let's check out the second thing that we have to do here. We have to make a check for things in which you hear the th sound and a cross for the things where you don't hear the th sound. Okay? The first one is feather. Feather. Th th feather. Correct. Leather. Leather. This material is called leather. The, the. We have it. The. Blouse. Blouse. Do you hear the in blouse? Nope. Rope. Rope. The. No the. Rackets. Rackets. The. Rackets. No. Brother. Brother, the, in brother. Check. And this is all done. Now it's your time to pause the video and draw here something which has the sound in it. You can draw your brother, you can draw a feather or anything where you can hear the. And once you are done, you can go to the next worksheet where you have to write the th sound. It's easy peasy lemon squeezy. You know how to write it. The things that are drawn here are feather, soother, and father. After writing, you can color in the pictures. Remember that to write the, you have to go down, turn a bit up, make a straight line. Then for you should make a stick go up, round, and down. Remember that a stick is longer than the t stick. Okay? Let's move forward and this is the best thing of our class which is blending. Now we will try to read some words. You can mute the video, try reading these words yourself or if you want to blend with me, go ahead. Th, a, that, that, the, e, the, s, this, the, a, the, m, them, the, a, the, n, then. Kudos! We completed our blending task. If you want to do it again, you can just go back and check it out. And now we are going to do the segmenting practice. For this, you need to have your copy and pencil ready because I'll be saying a few words that you have to write in your notebook. Okay, the first word is that, that. Sound out the words on your finger. The, a, t, that. Three sounds. Write the first sound, the. Second sound, a, that, that. There. Try writing the word them, them. How many sounds do you hear in this word? The, eh, mm. Three sounds. Let's start writing. The, eh, the, mm. them. The next word is this, this. Sound out the word. How many sounds do you hear? The, eh, s. This. Let's write it. Th. E. The. This. The last word is then. Then. The. Sound out. E. Eh. Mm. Let's write it. Th. A, eh. mm. then, voila, look at this, how easy it was. And now it's your treat time. This is your paper where you can do coloring. But remember, you have to color only in the pictures where you hear the, the 
sound. Okay, I'm saying the names of these pictures once so you can understand the sound. Bathe, reindeer, feather, carrot, mother. Now you have to decide where you hear the and color in those pictures. And at the end, this is your homework where you have to go to a park and find different feathers of birds and paste them on a piece of paper. And for the activity, you can color your feathers and make a crown with them. How's that? It will be fun. Do try it. And with this, this is the end of our today's class. I'll see you soon with something new. Take care. Bye for now. And don't forget to make it a great day. Bye.